unfortunate that this show isn't getting more attention because I think JC staff is killing it. And this show is actually so fun to watch. And the battle scenes that happened with the robot thing, no CGI. That's how I feel like Ninja Kamui should have been done. I haven't seen Ninja Kamui, but I have heard of the robot CGA fights and how bad it was done. What's the important plot points right now? The immortal furnace, basically a battery, right? You know, the power grid, we need power. What do we do? Uh, we sacrifice immortal souls. And right now we got a list of immortals that's supposed to be on the list. That's going to be a target for the immortal furnace, I think. And of course, everything is done by IHMI, which is run by Marcus. But Machina wasn't on that list. What does that mean? Well, intuitively, it's like she's not a target for the immortal furnace, but she isn't immortal. Is she so special that she's something else differently? There's also drones that was like spying on her back at her apartment. I feel like by the time we get back, she might be gone or we're being baited right now. Well, let's begin today's reaction. The drones. The deaths of the crucible. Okay. I'm probably gonna make curry chicken tonight too. <laughs> Change it up. Make it salty. Oh. Uh oh. Is it us? Don't open the door. Don't open the door. Ah! Holy shit, she just shot a beam at him, I think. But yeah, it's looking like she was taken. So this is like the backstory a little bit like earlier time. Demure. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Form change? Oh. Oh. I didn't realize you could do this shit. Oh my god, what the fuck? You see the booty cheek there? I saw some booty cheek. Yep, I, I saw that cheeked up right over here. Thank you, JC staff. Internet offline. But like, it's not gonna be enough to beat Marcus. Cause he's too powerful. They're both Gilgameshing it up. Dukeness of... What's the title? Dazzling Blaze. She's actually doing really well. But it's just gonna retach, right? Good googly moogly. She is packed up behind there. But like, an early lead is usually bad. I just feel like Marcus is familiar in his technology. It's too OP, too busted. Look at that region. More Gilgamesh. Our Demon Lord streaming setup. I can't believe this. Dude, we can't stream anymore. She's still good though. <laughs> still late for that. The Sakutan. <laughs> It's the English speaking Adresso. <laughs> Dude, her voice acting is so peak. <laughs> One more time. Adresso. Probably the funniest character so far for me. Duke of the Bloody Arts. More titles. What? She's just hacking. That's the bullshit thing. If you're... Fucking locked in with the familiar, right? And because IHMI, they control all that shit. You're gonna lose. <laughs> womp womp. <laughs> oh. Gokuro. <laughs> Shut down. Where did that come from? <laughs> <laughs> it's a model. <laughs> She's the best character. It's such a stupid like humor, but like 
English, like over exaggerated English voice acting is just so peak humor to me. Uh, oh. Fuck you, Marcus. Oh, okay. I thought he was thirsty for her. Did he just nut? I think this is like a power fantasy thing where it's not like the physical attraction, but like the power stance of like, I have so much power over you right now and you're on the ground and can't do anything. It's a weird level of perversion. <laughs> he just came in his pants. Standalone mode. Doesn't matter. There's other ways. They got a newer familia being made. You hit the back door of yours? Okay. Back doors. Yeah, back doors. Code break. And that's the best part. Our main character cannot have a familia. 100% we are going to be the counter. It's just like, are we at that level though with a million subscribers, right? Million followers on Twitch. The power was pretty good, but still, I think we need more against Marcus. And our streaming setup is over. Our streaming setup is busted. What are we going to do now? My Maukan. Power tripping. Yep. Just tired of living in the shadows. Skaran,情報と技術、それさえ掌握してしまえば世界を支配できる。私が絶対的な存在、すなわち魔王になる。この私が。うんうん。社長、時間です。It'd be hilarious if Veltal kept streaming so much and his whole demon lord persona brand. Expanded so much by the time that Marcus said that he's the true demon lord, everyone would call Marcus a fraud and this, say that he's copying the streamer. Immortal furnace. She's gonna be put into the furnace. She gone. She ain't here. We better go to the immortal furnace, wherever that is. Oh. And she was going to make curry tonight with love. Slice of life moments being used in a flashback. Always. Whenever something ha bad happens, slice of life moment flashback compels the character to get like revenge. The drone that was spying on us? We just follow it? Is it that simple? And the distant future, not so nearby. Or maybe actually pretty nearby. Amazon. They're gonna have drones, bro. Drones are gonna be knocking at your balcony, just dropping off packages. And it's gonna have all the surveillance footage, man. Hacking time. Activate laughing man. Yo, she's hacking it up. Beep, boop, beep, boop. Damn, she didn't even have to type anything. Everything was just vocal commands. Do this, do that. This is a new way of hacking. Alright, there's the footage. I love the soundtrack. The bass. Jeez. <laughs> that is kind of crazy. Look at that shit. Hello. Knock, knock. Who's there? 
Fuck you. Holy shit, it was on sight. Better go there and save her. You come with and hack everything. The hero. The hero, the hero. We have the hero who's super depressed right now. Though. I wonder if he's strong. Yeah. Bro, stop being so depressed. Come on. Wakey, wakey. Oh, the demon slord is swallowing. On one knee. Oh. Yes? なるほど感じていた。今画展が言った。頼むグラム。助け出すだけの力を持ち合わせておらぬ。だから。よにちか。ベルトール。yeah, yeah, yeah. Your people kill my people too. Fuck you. Come on. Yep. That's all you have to say. That was then, and this is now. It is what it is. Let's go. Just hit him with that was then, and this is now. Who cares? Move on, bro. Okay. We'll have a different source of power, I don't know. No, I feel like we do need a substitute power for the power grid. And probably the source of the power... I think it would be hilarious if we could just forever use Marcus as a battery. Forever and ever and ever. That would be like great revenge. But like, I don't think it's too unreasonable to believe that the Demon Lord's powers, once he you know, overtakes Marcus and everyone in the city acknowledges the Demon Lord. Veltal's own power and the faith, right, that was derived from this act will power the entire party of the city of Shinjuku. Yes. Now we're gonna save everybody. A hero can save both. Yeah. There it is. That's what a real hero is, man. Turning ideals into reality. It's not about saving one or the other. We can do both if you're an actual hero. I'm the demon lord, baby. You got a million followers on Twitch. Help me. There we go. <laughs> Watch him say no after all of that. Oh my god, I'd be so mad. He really doesn't think he's a hero, huh? Wait, wait, wait. He's getting his beliefs back. I'm doing this for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, the role play is crazy. Imagine random people watching this off in a distance. They're like, is this guy role playing as a demon lord? Dude, this guy's role playing as a hero. Holy shit, his lines are so overly dramatic. Oh my god. Now's the time. Now let's go to the furnace before Makina gets burnt. そのオートマッピング。オートマッピング。オートマッピング。オートマッピング。オートマッピング。オートマッピング。オートマッピング。オートマッピング。オートマッピング。オートマッピング。オートマッピング。オートマッピング。オートマッピング。オートマッピング。
冒険者としての教授はないのか Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> this is like the equivalent of like using like online video game guides rather than actually just going in blind as your first playthrough. Because if you're a true adventurer, then like you try to figure out everything for yourself, right? I mean, I mean, it's pretty convenient. I, 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 like, for example, like Dark Souls, like Elden Ring, you should just go into the wild and play it first playthrough just by yourself. But there's so much content that sometimes it's nice to have like a structured guide that you can use to kind of like. I don't know, make sure that you've covered everything, right? But, eh. Bro don't care. Bro has no respect for the game. I have never once thought about respect for the dungeon creator. Fuck that. It's funny though. They're just like bickering couples. You're more than pals, bro. This is like 20, you're like 10 years into this relationship bickering like old couples. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are we wasting time? What are we doing? Let's go. Automatic. Takashi stronger than Demon Lord and Hero confirmed. She looks like she just playing invisible piano because I can't see it. Nanda? She is. Most girls would probably gush by having, you know, the demon lord's like such soothing voice whisper nice things into an ear just like that, bro. We're almost there. She gone. I feel like that was genuine. That's how important Makina is. Was he? Are we being gaslit? Maybe that's true. It's her. Say something funny. Come on. English. Come on, more lines. Come on. Cliffhanger? The end? Alright. That was a quick episode. Is there a post credit scene? I don't... Oh, 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 I think there is. I think there is. Wait, 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 wait. Post credit scene? Wait, post credit scene? Hold it. We got some more. So this is the infernal immortal furnace. Marcus, you demon! I mean they are demons. Oh Looks like one big pop bottle. And that's today's episode of Mao 29. That was fast. I mean, this is a short as fuck reaction too. I was just so I don't know. The, the, the bulk of the episode, like the hype shit, I guess, was Marcus just showing up in front of Machina's place, Machina's transformation. Her design looks so, so cool. Both having like a Gilgamesh standoff. And then <laughs> the, what do you even say? The English secretary show up and just pop up. She truly is the peak of this show for me. Sumato, it's just, just fucking, that kind of humor. It's just right up my alley. And then the rest of it is like the demon lord and the hero. You know, two best friends, roommates, definitely not gay, by the way talking to each other and trying to convince each other that, you know, we should save the city. But, like, if you take care of Machina, if you save her, the city may go down because the power grid. But a hero should realize that you can... It's not one or the other. If you're truly a hero, 
you can make the pie and eat it too. We can save Machina and figure out, you know, a different way to power the grid. I don't think Veltal really has an idea what the hell that's going to be. He's basically just yapping. He's like, I don't know. I'll figure out a way. Maybe at the end, enough people will recognize Veltal's strength where his powers will be enough to just like fuel the entire city. Something like that. Or maybe we could have some really cool moment where Marcus is forever just bound as the immortal battery that will never, you know, die off. I think that would be fucking fantastic too. But that's it for me. If you're still here, and if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time... Take care.